Hi everybody, I'm Mike from Arcan Trailer. Today I'm gonna to show you the brand newly done, the Sanibel 3102 model. So it's brand new for 2020. Um, it replaces the 3202 from last year. They made a couple tweaks to the inside, shortened it up a little bit, and of course brought the price point down to reflect that. So we can go ahead and start on the outside. Very similar graphics to last year. You'll see Sanibel wide body, so that is talking about the 100 inch wide body construction. So 100 inch, what that's versus is the eight foot 96 inch that you'll see on about 90% of the trailers out there or fifth wheels out there. Um, so right away you'll notice nice two big electric uh, awnings with LED lighting. You got the basement storage and all Sanibels from the smallest one to the biggest one are six point electric leveling. Okay, and you can control that on a panel in the front or uh, a panel inside, which I'll show you when we head in there. Um, one, something brand new this year is in addition to kind of the, the Dexter axles that Primetime's done for a while now, they are putting a tire pressure um, monitor with both the Crusader and Sanibel line. So what that is, is it's a little module. There is a ring around these tires that helps gauge the pressure as well as the temperature. And you can keep that with you in the truck and it'll inform you if there's something wrong with the tire or something's off. And you can actually buy the caps for it and put them on your truck yourself and um, then you can monitor the tire pressure in your truck as well. So really cool new feature and, and a lot of value there. Um, just around back real quick, you'll notice all the Sanibels also have a rear ladder. So this is a walkable roof. You should go up there at least once a year to check all your seals um, and make sure everything's clean up there. The roof is made of a TPO um, membrane. So that's kind of the in lieu of rubber, which is they've been using in trailers for years. It's a little bit more fibrous. Um, it'll last you a little bit longer and, and won't chalk as much. Um, it is a snow load the roof. So like I mentioned, it is walkable and that's in uh, kind of combination of the structure of the five sided laminated walls. So your rear wall, side walls and slide out walls are all fully laminated. So a lot of strength, they call that the Eternabon construction. Um, Primetime talks about that a lot. What that's talking about is the fully caged aluminum frame. It's all welded together, but everywhere that a wall meets another wall or a wall meets the floor, they actually slide in a piece of wood to help when they screw it all together. Um, and then they weld the rest of the frame. So in addition to that Eternabon construction, this also has what they call the premium thermal package. So your underbelly is fully enclosed and insulated and heated underneath. So that runs off your 35,000 BTU furnace, which helps uh, keep your water lines from freezing up, your dump valves, all those types of things. And they are zero degree tested. When I say zero degrees, I'm talking Fahrenheit. So that's up to about minus 17 Celsius. Um, you could potentially stay in this coach for. Let's check out inside. Okay, welcome inside. So as you can see, they kind of updated the colors a little bit this year, blended some grays with the browns, brightened it up a little bit, new fixtures, a couple things like that. So a lot of stuff you'll see um, that, that's familiar in Sanibel, like the solid surface countertops everywhere in the kitchen here. Um, the nice upgraded appliances. So you got the big full-size microwave, the new oven. This is a convection oven as well. So there actually is a fan in there that'll help circulate the air if you're gonna be using it. You've got the same refrigerator as last year. So this is an electric fridge. It does have an inverter built in it to run off your battery um, while you're in transit, or if you wanted to set it up with solar or, or something like that. And then this is kind of the new feature this year is a nice big pantry. Those are uh, removable shelves if you have to adjust them up or down. And then you kind of got, you know, your little coffee pot area or whatever you want to use this spot for, and then your seating. So this is one of my favorite tables uh, in the industry. So there's no pedestal underneath. Um, I'm about six feet tall. Whenever I sit at an RV table, I'm, I'm definitely banging into something. Um, underneath this one, you don't have to worry about that. So you got the recliner seats. They've got the little USB ports built in. So you can charge your devices. And then um, back here, you got your fold out bed. So this is a new one this year. They, they changed it from kind of being a double size to being a little bit bigger. It's actually about the width of a queen bed. So that was a nice little upgrade. Um, entertainment, so it's got the Bluetooth sound bar that's connected to your speakers outside as well. Um, so you can have a zone one, zone two, inside, outside. And then you have your electric fireplace, which of course puts out 5,000 BTUs of heat, or like how I have it set right now, you can just use it for the, the ambient lighting. TV, um, it, it is on a, a motor, so it can raise up and down. If you're not the type to watch TV while you're camping, leave it down and you have yourself a nice window to enjoy a bit more of your view. Let's go upstairs and check out the rest of the trailer.
So um, heading upstairs, a couple things to show you before we get to the washroom and the master bedroom. First, you have a little LED light on a motion sensor, which is really nice to have late at night if you gotta run in from the campfire and, and use the washroom quick or what have you. And then you have a dual zone um, thermostat. So what that'll do is control A and B being downstairs and upstairs. There are two air conditioners on here. Um, one of them is 15,000 BTU and one of them is 13,500 BTU for the smaller upstairs. Um, and they're both on the, run on the quiet cool system. So you may have heard of this before, Sanibel does it for both air conditioners. What the quiet, quiet cool system does is it returns the air in the same place um, in, inside the coach. So it's circulating air through versus um, exhausting and, and taking in air at the same spot. So it doesn't have to work as hard. It's using less power and uh, it, it cools the coach a little bit quieter. You also have the switch for your inverter here as well. That's for your fridge. And then your little LCI touchscreen. So that has a few manuals in it. Um, so you can troubleshoot if you need for a different, uh, couple different electrical components in the coach, as well as uh, your auto leveling. You can use that to adjust your, your six point electric jacks. Other than that, we can head into the washroom. So it's got the nice sliding door for the washroom. So you don't have to worry about it getting all crowded up here. Vanity, big medicine cabinet, and then of course your nice big shower. I'm about six feet tall, so I can fit in here no problem. Lots of width. And then it's got the skylight for a little extra headroom if somebody's uh, you know even taller than I am. To the master bedroom. Notice the door does open the correct way versus opening outwards. <laughs> so you got the big chest of drawers, tons of closet space. This shelf can be popped out if you wanted to do uh, washer dryer prep. And then of course the uh, rest of your closet. So tons of shelving, cabinets, spot for shoes even, a place to hang. Um, all the Sanibels feature a king bed slide. It's really nice to have. You got the blackout blinds throughout the whole trailer. And then of course storage underneath. And uh, this is where you can see the air intake for your quiet cool AC. If you're wondering where that second air conditioner is, you can't actually see the unit itself. It's recessed up into the roof. That's part of what makes it run a little bit quieter. Um, that about does it for the new Sanibel 3102. I'm Mike from Arcan Trailer. I'll catch you next time. Hi everybody, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. This way you can stay on top of all our trailer demos, our walkthroughs, upcoming promotions here at Arcan Trailer. I'm Mike, I'll catch you next time.